Intel Pentium inside. Intel inside, see it, satellite, true talk mics for Cortana. It's a little scary. But we want to get the bike. Gary Fisher, Bond Treasure. I don't know. Let's take a look at that. This is a cool bag, I can tell you that. Holy crap. But that is nice though. Weird. I want to be careful with that. Okay. The Thinking Man, Roman Art Deco. Eight point five. That's whoo! Almost dropped that card. Here we go. Oh, there it is. Michael Jordan. Eight point five. Bummer. I thought that would have been a ten. It's so annoying trying to get a ten out of these guys. Here it is. Here. Interesting. Mmm. It's weird. I don't remember that ding right there. Do you, Benji? They swapped my card out, Benji. There was not a little ding right there. So, Edges got a 9. Probably that should have been a 10, I thought. That's a that's a $5,800 card right there. $5,800. $5,800. That one card right there. We got a 9 on this guy right here. Dark Skull. V-Dragon. That's kind of cool. We've got Michael Jordan, 8.5. Son of a biscuit eating bulldog. I was really hoping that was going to be a 10. Oh, they don't give very many 10s. Oh, the centering. See that? Centering, 8.5. Dummy. I see it now. Ah, oh, frick my life. Dark Magician Girl got an 8.5. That's not bad. That's not great. Could be a 9, 9.5. No, I don't think 9.5 PSA, but sometimes your cards can get more at... Ooh. The Michael Jordan rookie got an 8.5, and I, I thought that was a good one. Centering got an 8. Okay. This is the stuff you learn right here, and I'm saving you guys money. See right here? See right there? So that one's something maybe I shouldn't have graded. Blue Eyes White Dragon, 8.5. Oh, the, the man, the myth, the legend right here. An 8.5 right there. Gold medallion. <sighs> Let's see what we got here. Let's see what we got here. Peyton Manning, nine, Metal Universe, Indianapolis Colts. Peyton Manning, draft picks, a grade nine. That's not a bad one. Uh, I got a seven on my Charizard. Sucker mother, I guess, right there. Not really. I had to grade it anyway. It was worth a shot. Bummer, it's a seven. Oh, 8.5. This is kind of a cool one. Grade 9. Grade 9. Not bad. What else we got here? We got a Michael Jordan Upper Deck 9 right there. Star Rookies. Ooh, I used to have one of these in a 10 before I sold it. And now I have a 9. That's a bummer. I was hoping that would be a 10. That would have been cool in a 10. 9.5 so close another 9.5 are you freaking kidding me so basically these three if i sent them in to beckett i'd probably get a 10 i'd probably get a 10 if i took those three out and sent them in that's what a lot of people do in this business they do stuff like that i don't have the energy or time for all that crap oh what's this joe green ah uh, six that would have been nice if it was higher it's a rookie card a Joe Green rookie, but still pretty dope. What do you guys think of all these cards? Let's see if we're gonna get anything else in here. No, nothing. I should have had. I should have had. Uh, I should have had. Uh, a Barry Sanders rookie. But oh well, I'll see that. Not bad. Five thousand dollars. It's got to be at least at least ten grand right here. I hope y'all enjoyed that. I hope y'all enjoyed that. I'm very excited. I'm going to get to listing these. Boom, boom, boom. All of them going up on my eBay. So if you guys already don't follow me, Storage Auction Pirate, eBay. Appreciate that. Um, with that being said, the like button, share button, subscribe. Say something pretty. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, pirates of all ages, we are here in this unit right here. I am excited. Let's get to it. Oh, yeah. 
I bought this unit right here for sixteen hundred and seventy bucks plus expenses by expenses I mean I just paid almost 400 bucks to rent it for the month I'm kind of out of time we are gonna start getting to it I've bought a lot of units this week real quick a, a lot of people uh, I've had a couple comments of people are confused let me explain something to everybody how you doing when I buy something I buy a lot right so I don't just get to go through the storage unit it is not natural for one to take their time when you buy a storage unit if you're a real storage business runner it's different than what you see on youtube in the shows we stretch it out we waste time and energy making it a show that's not the normal way of running a business so example i bought this unit i got to get this 10 by 20 done in 48 hours no i don't have time for that so i had to rent it back i bought an 8 by 16 an 8 by 16 an 8 by 16 and i've already moved a 10 by 20 a 5 by 10 and a couple other units in the last week but you have a time crunch so I have to rent this to do it that way and I can't just do it in a sequence I have one day I come into this and one day I come to that anyway I'm hoping this is gonna be a good unit cut long story short reasons why I like this unit right off the bat I see this right here and I like that battery I'm, I'm wondering maybe there's a motorcycle in the back of this I like the weight bench Michael's been wanting one of those this thing catches my eye right here what is this right off the bat I'm liking that SE Richie and Sons I don't know much about that, but I'm thinking that is gonna be some money. This is a neat little chair. It goes on the side of a fridge. Uh, it goes on the side of the bathtub. That right there, believe it or not, is a good $15, $20 tops. Not a high resale value. Here we have a filter. What kind of filter? I don't know. Arctic air, dishwasher, hand wash, okay. Cheap little humidifier. Ooh, see the laptops right there. And we got a burger press. That's kind of cool. We'll keep going. Let's see what we got. All right. What have we got clothes-wise? Pizza Planet. I could see my child liking those. Toy Story. Okay. That's a little better now. What have we got here? Superman. Puma. Those look like they might fit Michael, actually. Let's see what else we got here. We got... American classic. Okay. I'm feeling these. I'm feeling this clothes a little bit. At least it's sellable, and that's what's important. Team Mario. Wow. Okay. I'm going to have to do a little bit of digging into a lot of stuff here, it looks like. Even when the clothes is exciting. We'll set the clothes aside. We're not going to go through every piece in this bag right here, right now. That's for show. Insignia. Maybe a television. Hmm. Huh heavy 101 for her room so let's see hdmi maybe it's a smart tv my children are all wanting tvs in their room now we'll see if i'll uh, see if we'll see how jess feels about that talking trees hp until penny on inside that's not bad what's that 50 to 100 bucks maybe Hopefully it works. We need some more laptops around the house, so I save money on buying a new one. Let's carry on. What do we have here? Oh. Intel inside, see it, satellite, true talk mics for Cortana. This looks like a pretty good one as well. Toshiba satellite, Windows 10. I'll have to take a look at these, but we've been needing more. We, both the kids want, well, not say both, but we have several kids. A couple of them want laptops, so that might suffice some needs there. What is this? Be something cool. Hair removal cream. Wax strips. No, very mundane. That's probably not the right word, Mike. Probably not the right word. This is a pole lamp worth about a buck fifty. Holy. Holy cannabis vet, man. Baby J cut that out. It's all their weed stuff, so they were definitely going to the club. Personal stuff.
Dad's dressers. Okay, Dad, what you got? A lot of clothes. Get a lighter. Looks like Dad was a coach. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, hell. Is he a cop? Chancaria Salsa. Okay. Cortina safety products made in Canada. Okay. How are you guys liking this so far? I forgot my tripod today, so we don't have that. Looks like crap again. So far, we're batting a zero here. We're batting a zero. I shouldn't say zero. We got about, I'd say, 100 bucks and stuff here, maybe. Not quite. With the clothes. TV, yeah, maybe a hundred bucks. We're really just trying to get in here. Mm. DeWalt drill. That's what, like five, six bucks? No, that's not bad. That's a good ten. And we got what under here? Very. Very weird. What I wanted was this bike because I got the bike to bring home to the little ones. Well, I may be the little woman, I should say. Oh, some type of cement machine or something. I don't know if I want to see much farther in here right now. It's a little scurry. But we want to get the bike. Alright. Thought this would be cool for one of the children. I'm uncertain if she's gonna like this bike. It's definitely one worth selling, but the the basket might make her not like this bike, but it is pretty freaking nice actually. I don't know. Maybe take the basket off. Which wouldn't be too hard. Gary Fisher. Bond treasure. I don't know. We'll take a look at that. Hmm. Harley Davidson ornaments. Those are kind of neat. I can see a lot of people wanting those. There's a beautiful little heart. We've got another Harley Santa piece here. Lily and Vernon. What's that? That could be cool. Okay, not bad. A lot of Avon pieces. I see what looks like a lot of Avon and cheaper ornaments and then there was a few on the top there that were very cool frolicking Santa ornaments. Nice. This is not bad. This is not bad. Ooh, what do I what are my eyes deceive me here? Spot check, 101 Dalmatians, best friend. And that is a wrap. And we got a Coca-Cola ornament. Let's take our time to see what's in there. Christmas is coming, look at this. What is this? This is a cool bag, I can tell you that. Eastman Outfitters. I consider that a cool item. Because I consider that 25, 30 bucks. Mm, yeah. Such a weird array of stuff, alright? I don't want to go on that one guys, I'm sorry. I'm trying to show you everything here, but this is like literally almost impossible to show you everything in a storage unit and literally go through everything in a storage unit and literally deal with everything in a storage unit. Uh, I'm trying, I'm trying to find that fine line guys. Let's see what we got here. Something caught my eye right here. This guy, not you. Let's put you right there. What is this? <clears throat> Art? It is. Alright, we don't want to pull on it and mess it up. I see boxes. I see a microwave. I see another television. I see so much stuff I can't even get to it all because I have to pull it out. So that was wrapped up in paper there in the front. I probably owe that in their Comcast bill. The Walking Dead 2016. Hmm. 
I uh, can't tell who it is, but this is kind of cool. So I'll hold it out. Can you, anybody can guess? Burger King. Probably a Burger King. It's becoming to be a little bit of a mess up in here to do a lot of serious filming already. I got stuff falling on me, hit me in the head. We got this beautiful flamingo. That's kind of cool. Is it a $5 yard art piece right there? That's still cool. The yard art's hot. Kids clothes. I don't want to go through that. Nice little blanket though. That's a good $5, $10 blanket right there easily. We have uncovered surface area. And we are getting into kitchen stuff. Kitchen stuff is always important. Because you can see how... A, they kept care of their stuff and the type of things that they bought. That's kind of almost cool. Under Armour. They were athletic, so I can see that. <laughs> the infamous beef jerky maker. Every kitchen box is noisy, so I don't think I'm destroying stuff over here. This I kind of like for taco night. I do like that. I'm going to take this home for the little woman. And I, one, two, three, four, five, six. You put your taco shells in there, right? And you lace them up. The last item I'm going to get into today because I want to go home. I'm tired and I got a lot of work to do at the house. Is I want to see in one tote. So we're going to come here and we're going to open this one tote. And... It's got some weird habanagerie. Treasure Majorajerie. That is all oh, really well wrapped up here. Oh, I give up on that one. Let's come in here and see what we can find. Oh, great. Mask. I thought that was some panties or something. Everything is just really well wrapped in here, so I can't even... I can't even get to what it is. It looks like... Somebody used like sports tape and it's like the most annoying thing to pull off. This looks kind of cool. It's like a Fenton hobnail glass piece here. So that could be cute. Like a little mini picture. We'll get it to it guys. Come on. We're going to get to it. Holy crap. But that is nice though. That, yeah, that does look exactly like Fenton. They bought it at Goodwill. They had taste. That is a nice piece right there. That's kind of cool. It's broken. Weird. I want to be careful with that. Okay. The Thinking Man. Roman Art Deco. Cool glass. I don't see nothing. I'm not like seeing nothing that's just super expensive. It just looks like a lot of neat little stuff. Good stuff for Alameda right there. Like that could be like 10 bucks in Alameda. Let's see if it's... Oh yeah, a picture. A picture's worth a thousand words. What do you guys think? Alameda that? Dang, it's got a chip, see? Wow. Bummer. There's a lot of just glassware in here. Really weird. And that's probably all I'm going to go through today, guys. I don't want to get too much crazy in here. It's been a long day. We will come back to this unit in the later date for show. We rented it. We got to pick up a unit on Wednesday by ourselves. And then two units on Friday with Alex. And we're going to make a, a slew of boxes with the storage stalker videos. So that's coming up. And yeah, I think that's a fun little box. I have high hopes for this storage unit. We're only 2,000 deep into it without any more expenses. I've got at least 100 or so, but I got actually with the laptops and the, the doodad for aquatic stuff and the bag. There's a couple hundred bucks in that tote. We got a whole storage unit here, and I'm going to load this bike home, and I'm going to bring it home to the little woman to see if we can get these tires pumped up. Well, that unit so far is not quite what I was hoping it to be, but I still see profit to be made, and that's what's most important. We're a couple hundred bucks in... And we're only a few feet in and we haven't even scratched the first few feet but i see lots of potential in there and we even got the little woman a nice bike jess i hope you enjoy it if you don't we'll give it to anaya or michaela one of the somebody one of y'all at the home better enjoy that dang bike because we need bikes and um 
Apparently our Christmas one sucked. Anyway, we'll be back to this unit someday soon. I'm all over the map. I hope you guys understand that that's just the way it goes. One day I'm in one, one day I'm in the other. The next day on my list, I'm going to pick up an 8x16, whether I film it or not, or just move it. And then from there, we pick up two more 8x16s. And then we come back to this unit. And you still got other ones we've seen, but that's what it is. Pirate life, storage auction cold reality of the business where scare money don't make money and cash is king.